Thomas Callas launches the ball long, looking for the run of Semenyo. Now Jada Silva landed into his path. Can he find the perfect cross? It's floated all the way through to Sam Bell, and Matson is able just to gather the ball. Well but for him and Benarus, tracking back. How about that from the youngster? Finds a lovely pass into Semenyo as well. Weidman with the ball across the box, and Martin was lurking in behind. Dominic Hyam there, Bristol City will have the corner. Tim Closer is just on the edge of the box there, coming from deep. He's going to maybe look to nick it on the end. Andy Vyman arriving, can't quite steer his head of goal. Brown ends up under the advertising there. Came off the bench against Swansea following the injury to Max O'Leary. A flick from Martin, and that's good. Those three combining well. Here's Masengo. Vyman made a run through the middle, was left unmarked. Here's Benarus back onto his left foot. Could there be a first goal for him or even this man? Masengo shoots. Gathered by Moore. Good patient build up. Very good. Here's Clark Salter, the former Chelsea man. So our distance for our units here, we've dropped into like a little block. So the, the front three to the back three is a lot closer. Chipped into a very dangerous space there. It's Matson in an open the scoring for the Sky Blues, completely against the run of play. It sends the Coventry City fans wild in the away end. And he's one player that's avenged his mistake earlier on this season, being sent off in the return fixture. First blood to Coventry City. Really didn't see that coming, did we? Could see a release of emotion there from the 19-year-old. Flick from Semenyo, not too far away from finding Vyman. Just feel with those two up top, particularly and Martin as a decoy. A there's always a chance for Bristol City. Here's Semenyo, best chance maybe now for the home side. Dragged it across. Vyman can't believe it. I think he was caught in two minds there, Semenyo. The first two players with a bit of whip. Just a bit. It goes there. from Scott. Semenyo rises oh. high. It's ricochets off the crossbar. What a powerful header that was. We've not seen that too many times from Semenyo. He can't believe he's not scored. What a delivery. The header was hit with such ferocity as well. I am forced into a quick pass. Up it goes towards Semenyo, who's oh, grappled yeah. again by the centre half. Really struggling to contain him. Bell has space, options in the box. Swung in, back to Masengo. He shoots, will he get a second chance? His eyes lit up there. Oh, oh glorious build-up place. Oh. Masengo can't quite get the back lift there on his shot. It's a little toe poke, wasn't it? He just didn't have the room. Better play, isn't it? Moving the ball quicker. Oh, wow. Cries of a penalty in yeah. there as well. This last 10 minutes has been the best spell for Bristol City in this game. Here's Callum O'Hare though, cuts onto his right and again unleashes the shot, footwork. Oh. Impeccable again from Dan Bentley. And whilst the shot will disappoint Callum O'Hare, still an awkward one for Dan Bentley to parry away. Alex Scott will take this. Tim Closer and Semenyo line up, but the corner goes short. Jada Silva waits for the youngster to arrive on the overlap. Swung back in, Vyman's waiting. Not a good yes, cross. get him. And it's Chris Martin to level the scores. That front three are at it again. This time Vyman with the assist. Chris Martin buries it in that far corner. And Bristol City, for all their huffing and puffing, pull the scores level. It's great that we have capitalised now and again get that goal with all the possession. So we'll keep that momentum. Let's see if we get the second. Put them to the sword. 
It's an excellent touch there from Jokerez, and now commentary can side. break. Alex Scott with a vital interception, but the danger has not passed. Back to Bidwell. Coventry looking dangerous. Matson looking for his second. A fine stop from Dan Bentley. Lunges out to his right hand side, but well, they can't require the services of Gordon tonight, who got the winner earlier on this season. Oh and that's God. off the crossbar, unmarked to the back post. A sharp of intake of breath from City fans. And yeah, it goes right. from Masengo, lovely ball, looking for Vyman, had real whip and purpose on it. Well done, close. Go on. Here goes Semenyo, he's on side, checks back inside, finds Chris Martin, can he find oh. the finish? Oh, so close, Moore gathers. Did well, the keeper Beautiful build-up play, though, from Bristol City. Brave, brave, the keeper there, he's on his money. In ordinary games, Alex Scott would be a man of the match in oh. plenty of Bristol City's recent fixtures. Hitch Joe Williams then. Bristol City, a feel, would be worthy of a win here late on. Asengo tries to poke it to Williams. Bristol City, though, left exposed. Jokerez is unmarked. Here is Jokerez to finish. And it's a late, late goal for the Sky Blues. The away fans go berserk. Heartbreak at the death with Bristol City attacking with real purpose. And it's another late goal against the Sky Blues that could be Bristol City's undoing tonight. He's their top scorer. He's got 11 now for the season. How many minutes of additional time? In it goes from Thomas Callas. Meets the first man needed to breach him. It is five minutes of added time. Joe Williams checks back in. Needs to be a good delivery. Tim Closer oh. with the header. My word, that was hit with pace. I thought that was it. Nail biting stuff, I think he did too. Moore was beaten all ends up. The delivery was exceptional. <laughs> 